Well, it's time now for the weekend rundown, helping you plan for the weekend ahead. Yes, and of course, there's a lot happening now that it's the new year oh, and yeah. events are starting to kick back into high gear, which right. we always love. And joining us to help sort through some of those events you shouldn't skip this weekend is Danny from the Luke and Howell Morning Show on WLLR. Good morning, Danny. Hey. Good morning, Charles. Good morning, Devin. So nice to see you guys. How you doing first part? I mean, I know it's just really new, but 2024 is here. How you yeah. doing? Oh, we're trying to truck along. I don't but... know. I don't know yet. <laughs> Those days. <laughs> but no, Happy New Year to you. Happy New Year. <laughs> Thank you. Happy New Year. Yeah, so far, so good, right? Yeah. 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 We're going to get there. And, and yeah. actually, for the first weekend, there's actually a lot that's going yes. on, right? Yes. And we're actually going to start <laughs> with the Bald Eagle Days. And this is actually so cool. It's happening at the QCCA Expo Center. And a fun thing about this one, it's actually the Midwest's largest celebration of our nation's bird, the bald eagle. And the event coincides with the time of year when thousands of bald eagles migrate to the greater Quad City area region to feed off the Mississippi River. And I know included in this is also some uh, bald eagle watching. Oh yeah. Um, and I remember uh, going to a similar event like this last year and seeing a bald eagle just like 10 feet away from me. It was just surreal. That's what I was going to say. So cool. And yeah, no, and um, a part of this event, of course, you know, live eagle watching, like I just said, bird of prey demonstrations and other animal and insect educational opportunities. And there will also be crafts and vendors and thousands of people are expected to show up to this annual event. You just so, saw the video there I looking know. at the kids. <laughs> <laughs> That's for you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm going, Matt. I'm going, oh, you man. Are. Oh, I, hey, I cannot perfect. wait to see. You know, it's just really cool when an eagle just like yeah. swoops down and just grabs that fish right out of the water. Oh, yeah. so cool. I just, I just yeah. still can't get over like seeing a bald eagle or just an eagle in general up close. It's I know. So beautiful. It's almost so like a, a, a pet that yeah. you're just, you know, you're trying to get your hands like, on. Right? I'm actually looking at our nation's bird right now. You yeah. know, that's what I always think. It's like, wow. Oh, <laughs> yes, so. it's going to be so awesome. But, yeah. Well, who says that we can't still be in the holiday spirit? I didn't say it. <laughs> right? <laughs> Let's talk about the February holiday lights for the last weekend that the display is going to be going on. The February Learning Center, the, the, the park in Davenport there. Again, it's going to be the last weekend, and on Sunday is when everything wraps up. So it's from 5 to 9.30 p.m. every 15 minutes there. Um, the show is it's just only 15 minutes, I should say, and there's going to be a new one every 30 minutes. And you just go to the park and park, watch at the event, and yeah, yeah. definitely just enjoy the time with some family. Yeah. And, have, you know, it's for free as well. So yeah, who you can't get enough of that. You don't have to, you don't have to, you don't have to get outside, just turn on the radio. There it is. You know, listen yes. to the music. It's all so, synced up beautiful. together. Yeah. <laughs> right. You're continuing with the holiday theme, right? With the pay what you want admission days for the holiday lights at the Botanical Center? Yeah, absolutely. Yep. Pay what you want. And, and because I, I think what they're trying to do is just avoid taking the lights down as long as possible. Yeah. <laughs> I mm -hmm. mean, there's so many. I don't blame harder, them. not harder. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> so tonight, tomorrow, and on Saturday, so you've got the 4th, 5th, and 6th. Uh, they're going to be doing 5 to 8 o'clock. Just pay what you want, but uh, definitely check their website and uh, find out how you can get those tickets in advance. But enjoy, because this is really is your last, last big push. Oh, awesome. it doesn't get much better than that, because, nope. I mean, yet again, it's, it's allowing families to come in and just yes. enjoy the time at, you know, really a convenience for yeah, so many. Absolutely. Yeah. It's, oh, it's almost like the 12 days of Christmas, you know, that last yeah. push of the last right. push of that holiday cheer and that festive That's true. decoration. Yeah. So we just love and, yeah. and a tradition as well absolutely. for so many. And so, Danny, you're also talking about um, the Harlem Globetrotters, right? Yeah, talk about a tradition. Yeah. I mean, great for the whole family. So much fun as they do their world tour this year. And they wow. come into Vibrant Arena at the Mark on Monday. Now, I know it's not the weekend, but oh. if you want to you know, a little extra fun on the end of your weekend, Monday night. You can still get tickets, um, but you can check it out. They start at 7 o'clock. But they do a pre-show thing, which you can get. You have to have a magic pass for that. But that starts at like 530. So, okay. I mean, it's just a lot of fun. I've been watching um, little documentaries on the Globetrotters. And, uh, I mean, just the history and just the great um, 
way that they're out in the community and promote themselves, it's just, yeah. it's its marvelous. It's yeah. really fun. They're fun to watch. That's always mm -hmm. a favorite because they're just so creative. I, I, I don't know how they do it. A lot of practice, of Yeah, course. I'm still trying to practice. get the basketball to spin <laughs> on my one on your finger. Just like spin it with the, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and it's the hard great to do. nicknames. Oh, so good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. it's impressive. And you know, it's always a blast for all oh. children. So, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, we want to thank you, Danny, for joining thank us. Thank you, Danny. Good morning, Quad Cities. And we'll see you next week. That's it.